That would be me. Look who we're hanging with. Jason David Frank. Boom shakalaka. Please do not change channel. All right, welcome back. Thanks for logging on and tuning in. If you haven't already, hit that like button and subscribe. That way you can keep coming back over and over to hang with us and our wonderfully talented and creative guests in the arts and entertainment world. I am Allison Murray, and right now we're at the Orange County Convention Center in Orlando, Florida at Megacon 2018, and we are hanging with our good friend, comic book writer, James Hake, not Cake. <laughs> How you doing? Thanks for I'm, having me back. Thank you for coming back on. So what have you been doing in a year? Uh, it's been a crazy year, great year. Um, let's see, uh, my original series, Solar Flare, keeps on coming out. We're at season three now and just released both trades since last time I saw you. Oh, wow. Got season one and two, which is awesome. And I'm about to release my next book, who I co-created with uh, Don Hanfield, who's a producer in Hollywood. He's uh, partners with Jeremy Renner. And uh, we're doing a book called The Mall. It was uh, Scout's first free comic book day offering. Came out in May, and the concept of this one is it takes place in everybody's favorite decade, the 1980s, where a criminal organization was run out of some shady stores in the mall, and the head of that organization dies, and his three in kids inherit these stores. So, and as you can imagine, craziness pursues. So it's kind of a cross between um, The Sopranos and Breakfast Club. So the release comes out in uh, July is when everything's coming out. And some pretty awesome news is our artist is from Brazil, and he's never been to America before. And I'm going to be hosting him at the end of July. We're going to be doing Tampa Bay Comic Con and a few other in-store signings across the state. Uh, his name is Rafael Loerio, and a great, talented artist. And we're going to be doing kind of a, the mall tour. Yeah, one of the signings, I'm so excited, it's going to be like an 80s party. So everybody's going to dress up in 80s clothes. And yeah, it's, uh, we're really going with that whole 80s theme. But it's been, it's been an awesome year. I've uh, become the marketing and sales director of Scout, and I'm now a partner. And we're moving our headquarters to Fort Myers, Florida, where I'm from. We're going to have our office and a warehouse and a showroom. And that's going to be opening up in June. But a lot of big things for Scout, myself, and a whole bunch of the creators going forward. It's, it's exciting. It's I been know. a great time. Oh, my God, James. That's so awesome. Um, what um, inspires you to keep doing what you're doing? Uh, it's got to be my love for comics. And I just, I'm a natural salesman. That's what I do for my day job. I'm a financial advisor. And I don't know, I just... It, the passion for comics has always been there and continues to grow. I'm hope, like I'm not obsessed, but it's awesome. And I, the people that I've been meeting, and it just it's a great industry to be in, a very tight knit community. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I just I really love doing these shows and meeting the fans and, and telling stories. I mean, that's the big thing. Got where do you where do you draw your inspirations from to get your stories? Gosh, I don't know. A lot of them just come to me. Uh, the mall one just takes, gosh, I came up with that idea so long ago. It's loosely based on the mall that I, in, when I was growing up, called the Edison Mall. And we used to always go there. I'm an 80s, 90s child, and that was the big thing to do. You go with your friends to the mall. And I've always loved crime stories, so that kind of naturally happened. And got a couple other books. Uh, my love for pro wrestling is I have another book coming out called Long Live Pro Wrestling, the same month of July. It's uh, Scout's new binge imprint, which we're releasing a single issue, uh, kind of like a teaser, and then we're doing a season where it goes straight to trade. So that's going to be the first title of the binge, and just I'm taking concepts and stuff that I love and just trying to create stories, really. Wow. So much going on. So much. <laughs> yes. Um, are there any characters um, or stories that you're dying to tell that you haven't really done yet? Yes. Baseball. So baseball story I have in mind, and I, I used to play baseball. I'm a diehard Oakland A's fan. And people can always find me by having my Oakland A's hat on. 
But uh, yeah, I want to tell a story about a manager. Um, just a lot of people look at a manager or coach as like just managing the game. But if you think about it, over a course of a long, long baseball season, they're managing 24 personalities from very rich people to very, you know, people just barely breaking in. I just find that fascinating that what goes on behind the scenes. So that's the one that eventually I'll tell. It's going to be a while though. I'm just so busy. So. Um, who or what um, are your biggest influences in your life or your career, do you think? Um, in my life, it's my wife, my family, and my daughter. Um, she's huge. That's kind of how, you know, Solar Flares started loosely based on myself and about what would you do if your daughter was, you couldn't get to your daughter in a post-apocalyptic, realistic setting. So, huge influence. And then career-wise, um, I'd have to say James Pruitt. He's our publisher. Uh, I've become very good friends with him. We always go JTP because that's his initials. So he's been huge, and uh, my partner's at Scout, great guys. So those are the, my influences, and my loving wife who supports me. She's awesome. That's always good. Yes. <laughs> um, are there any restrictions um, that you find working in the comic industry? Um, restrictions. Hmm. Or are you pretty well free range to do what you yeah, want to do? What's so awesome about comics, uh, you know, with movies, a budget. I guess in comics, in a weird way, it's a budget too. You can only do so many, especially if you want to pay the creative team, uh, you know, up front. So that's really the biggest limitations I've found. But all, any idea can come out on a on a page thanks to an artist's, you know, artist's yeah. imagination. So you don't have as many limitations. Just cost of producing a book, I think. Um, and we know that you frequent a lot of cons. So where um, are you going after Megacon? One, I'm going to be in Fort Myers, which is where I'm from. There's a local con co called Southwest Florida Space Con. That's in the middle of June. Uh, then I'm potentially going to Seattle for Ace Comic Con, which I believe is their second or third. And then San Diego Comic Con in July. And then Tampa Bay Comic Con in August. So a little busy schedule here. Yeah, yeah on top of everything else that you've got going yeah. on. Um, and remind people where they can find you and your comic book. Oh, great. Well, um, social media, um, Twitter, you can follow me at, at James Hake, H-A-I-C-K, uh, at Solar Flare Comic. And then I have Facebook pages for all my comics and Scout, of course, at Scout Comics. So just type in basically Long Live Pro Wrestling for the wrestling one after Facebook, the Mall Comic, Solar Flare Comic, and Scout Comics. Fantastic. Do we have time for a game? You know we like to play games like on this too. show. Let's go. Okay. We are going to play some Dirty Minds. Dirty Minds. Okay. <laughs> and you know we don't have time to play Dirty Minds. Okay. So basically we're just going to pick a square. Okay. We're going to give each other the three clues, and then we're going to try to guess what we're trying to All right. say without embarrassing ourselves too much. <laughs> Let's see. Uh... Ah uh, no! Ah uh, no! Let's see. You want me to go first? Break the ice? Yes. All right. Okay. <laughs> I am covered with a dense growth. Okay. I am hot, moist, and dark inside. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's dangerous to be inside me without protection. So is it a person? Is there any clues, other clues you can give That's me? That's it. That's it. Chocolate? Oh, no. Wait, another guess. Let me, uh, I'm covered with a, a dense growth. Okay, that's probably, is that James Brewer? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not okay. I'm hot, moist, and dark inside. It's dangerous to be inside me without protection. Jungle. <laughs> oh. All right, my turn. You ready? It's hard to get me off. The rear is where I usually get stuck. I drive home your points. I'll do it one more time. It's hard to get me off. The rear is where I usually get stuck. And I drive home your point. I want to say like one of those uh, golf cutter things. Nope. <laughs> one more guess. Uh, uh, no. Bumper sticker. Bumper sticker. <laughs> Wow, Do we have time for one more? I love this game. Yeah, one more? Right. Let's play one more. Okay. 
I don't care what Harry says. <laughs> uh, I have designs on your body. After I'm done, there are always stains. <laughs> you pay to po oh, you pay me to poke you, but it hurts. Tattoo. Yes. yes. <laughs> do you want to do one or are you? Yes. Yeah, let's out? play okay, one, one more. <laughs> oh boy. Your hands move me into the right position. I stick up between two people. If I'm in, if I'm in a small one, I rub against your leg. <laughs> so, a cat, <laughs> a, a puppet. <laughs> Very good guess. Gear shift. Ooh. Close <laughs> oh, I was so totally off base. Okay. <laughs> well, guys, once again, we've had a blast team with James today. I am Allison Murray, but before we go, we would like to give a special thank you to our partners at Krypton Radio out of LA, Famous Faces and Funnies, Off the Chain Radio with Yvonne Mason, Space Coast Comics, Asylum Convention Entertainment Services with Heather Reed, our great friends at Summon Unique Magazine. These are the folks that share our videos all over the World Wide Web, and we hope you will too. Don't forget to hit that like button, leave a comment, let us know what you think of today's show and our guest. You can also check our guest links below. Remember to subscribe, log on, and stay tuned to see who we're hanging with next. Thank you.